हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू कंप्यूटर साइंस एंड आई टी गेट कोचिंग डोंट फॉर गेट टू सब्सक्राइब माई चैनल एंड प्रेस दी बेल आइकन टू गेट दी इंस्टेंट नोटिफिकेशन ऑफ माई फ्री लेक्चर n okay so if any number of n first we can start we can assume both n m s equal to zero so epsilon belongs to the language see this way you should write first you should write the string that belongs to the language since here it is given that n m is greater than equal to zero you can assume n and m as well as both as zero now if if you uh, give some values of n and may assuming m s zero then you will have any number of a any number of a then make n equal to 0 and increase it then you can have b any number of b so here n is 0 and you are increasing m giving the value of n now any number of a then any number of b is there like this these are the kind of string belongs to the language if shall have any number of a any number of b any number of a followed by any number of b but if when you got b there there will not be any a so after b after b if you got b there should not be any so here the string can start with a starts with b if silent belongs to the language only restriction is that after b there should not be any a because it is saying a equal to m b equal to m a n greater than equal to 0 so initial state i need to make it as a final state because if silent belongs to the language now any number of a i need to accept it and if any number of a is coming so i i have to make a loop here any number of a see i am making a any number of a loop in the beginning if you are getting see it can even start with b you go there then accept it then any number of b p there see some student they do they first make this as final state and they make this state any number of b in the beginning they are going to give then any number of a they are going here see if you do like this Yeah, it can start with any number of a. It can start with any number of b. The problem is that if you put the loop of b in the beginning, then after b it is having it. But b a like b a is not belongs to the language. See, after b there should not be any. That's why I'm keeping a loop of a in the beginning in the initial state that is even called as a start state. Because if you are getting any number of a, accept it. After that you are having b. Any number of b, accept it. Now, but after b there should not be. So this is wrong. Okay. So after b there should be, there should not be a. So if you are getting a, go to dead state and reject it. Any combination of a comma b reject it. So for this state you have given the transition of a b. For this state also you have given the transition of a b. For this state also you have given. So this is a minimal DFA for a to the n, b to the n, n m greater than equal to 